so I've got all my grills back on and I'm trying to figure out what this tweeter is doing and then swap it out with the date and reference series. See how that one does. I'm still in the process of fine tuning these for the, the final build, let's say. So I've got a fully assembled operational pair of speakers, but I'm at that point where now I'm really tweaking them. I play music over these speakers. So if you have headphones or an AVR, you know, home theater system, stereo hooked up to your TV or whatever, uh, yeah. Those, uh, those times when I'm actually playing the speakers, um, what you're hearing is the speakers. Just being picked up and recorded by uh, my Pixel 7 phone. So sound quality, you know, honestly, it hasn't been too bad. When I listen back to it, it sounds pretty good. It helps me tune them too, because as I bring the camera closer to them, you can kind of pick up subtle differences that you really can't pick up with your ear. So that's kind of cool too. But uh, yeah. I'll so I've switched over to the Pixel 7 mic from my lapel mic. And I'll go ahead and turn this on and see if we can't find some royalty-free music to listen to. I'm running everything off of this old NAD T757 receiver. It does the job pretty good. Kind of representative of, I don't know, maybe not all receivers, you know, but a lot of receivers people might have. Basically, all I got to do, pull these tweeters out. I have to make uh, a connection for the resistor to the tweeter. I'm going to need to center that tweeter up on this hole. Make sure that it can cover these screw holes. It's going to need four new holes mount, uh, you know, drilled in there for mounting it. So that's what's next. Let's get started. That's all there is to it. Um, so I've got the Dayton reference tweeter mounted in this speaker. Next video, make sure you don't miss that one. What I'm gonna do is frequency sweep the speaker with the silk dome, and then I'll go ahead and frequency sweep this one with the reference. So this is the Dayton classic uh, silk dome tweeter. This is a Dayton reference um, it's a fabric or silk tweezer, one of the two. But I wouldn't let you go without hearing this for the first time with me. And that's another reason if you're a first time viewer, you want to stay tuned because everything I go through for the first time you're going through. I haven't heard this speaker yet. Let's turn it on and see what happens. This is going to the Pixel 7 mic.
it's working. Sounds pretty good too. Yeah, I'm anxious to hear what it sounds like when uh, it's playing music, see what the frequency sweep is like. It definitely looks better. I'm gonna chalk this up as a win today. <laughs> 